सो इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू टॉक अबाउट वीनस एज तारा कार का सो आई विल एक्सप्लेन यू वेरी डीपली हाउ टू चेक इट सो स्टे ट्यून्ड एंड इफ यू वॉन्ट टू टेक पर्सनल कंसल्टेशन यू कैन कॉन्टैक्ट मी फॉर दैट राइट सो लेट्स गेट स्टार्टेड सो वीनस एज तारा कार का फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल दारा कार का इज लाइक द सेवेंथ लॉर्ड ओनली इट विल टेल यू अबाउट योर स्पाउस इट इज द सेवेंथ लॉर्ड फ्रॉम जेमिनी एस्ट्रोलॉजी it can tell you about your spouse's profession the theme of your marriage what will be the theme of your marriage and also about how your spouse can look what will be your spouse's behavior with you their profession and what kind of life they must be living okay what kind of partner you want to have right so it tells you everything it is a very important planet right so when venus is a dara karka venus is a planet of relationship and uh, it is very good to have venus as your dara karka it is a benefic planet and uh, it's very good to have uh, if you want to have a proper relationship it's very good to have venus as dara karka okay so if you have venus here as dara karka it can give you a very loving caring emotional materialistic sensual spouse they can be highly artistic as well they will be good looking okay for benefic aspects are there then a very high possibility they will be good looking either their eyes can be very beautiful they have, they can be charming they can have the dressing sense so these things can be present in your spouse i'm not saying that they are going to be like very very good looking very extremely good looking but still they will be decent looking and yes a person who actually can be perfect for you right better than you we can say so uh, depending upon if venus is not influencing you in your chart if moon connects with venus or mars it can give a very uh, good looking personality okay cute face glowing face a uh, charming face innocent looks right so but venus in libra will not give you very fair looking spouse depending upon the country you are living it can give you a um, spouse who has like whitish or brown brown kind of skin okay and uh, for your spouse it will be very important how they look it doesn't mean that they are going to all the time spend money on Uh, different brands it does it only means that they will want to look decent will want to look good in the society okay they can wear very simple clothes but they will want to look decent right and uh, depending upon certain placements they can also be interested in different brands quality brands especially if venus is retrograde then they they will only wear branded things they may not like uh, something that is uh, cheap or is not of very good quality they will see the quality of everything stubborn kind of nature very different kind of dressing sense they can have so if venus is retrograde your spouse can wear very unusual dresses now you have to see the strength of venus where it is placed which house it is placed and uh, the strength of venus you have to see for example it is placed in the 6th house so after marriage your 6th house will get activated it shows you have to pay off some karmic debt to to your spouse there are some karmas that you have to clear to your spouse in this life okay in 12th house it can uh, soon after marriage it can give you foreign travels or you can face losses depending upon the navamsha acquired by venus now you also have to check this thing venus in the d9 chart as well as the d60 chart which sign venus is placed in your navamsha okay that is the future of your marriage that can be the future of how your spouse is going to behave with you in the later half of your life okay so you have to see where venus is placed now d60 if a birth time is accurate you can also see the houses but at least you can see the sign so uh, but you need a accurate timing at least like 30 seconds or 1 minute 
so you can see where venus is placed in the uh, t60 it will also tell you many things about the quality of your spouse okay the quality of your marriage so you can see this way as well also your spouse will be very harmonious will not like to indulge in any kind of fights your spouse a uh, spouse will want to maintain peace relationship can be very important for your spouse okay it is also possible that they may have been in many relationship before or you may have been in many relationship before not only your spouse for you also relationship is very important you value relationship you value romance and romance in relationship is very important thing there should be romance there should be love there should be care right uh, like fairy tale kind of romance for um, most of the people like fairy tale kind of romance for most of the people now if venus is with mars right it can make the spouse highly passionate they may also want to indulge in fights and there can be arguments or lack of understanding because mars is involved if sun is involved it can make your partner egoistic or a very show off kind of personality especially if venus is ahead of sun right so these things can be present in your chart egoistic personality with sun if within 9 degrees okay but no matter what if these things are not there your spouse is going to be very calm minded okay if with jupiter jupiter a uh, mutual aspect or conjunction okay i'm talking about mutual aspect if it is fifth or ninth aspect it is better because venus is not looking at jupiter okay only jupiter is giving its positive aspect because jupiter is a beneficial planet so there can be tug of war like spirituality and materialism so you may want to enjoy materialistic pleasure romance love with your spouse but you may not be able to enjoy that after marriage okay because jupiter is looking at venus mutual aspect two enemies are looking at each other so uh, ultimately uh, there can be tug of war like mind may want to have romantic relationship but jupiter that represents your soul may want to have spiritual relationship or go into spirituality so this thing can be there even with your spouse can be there okay and uh, dara karka basically tells you about what is your thought about relationship what you actually think relationship uh, relationship should be like okay so your partner can also be very attractive and wealthy if it is related to wealth houses your partner can bring wealth in your life if it is related to trick houses you may have to give your wealth to your spouse your spouse can also be very diplomatic if jupiter is aspecting can be very knowledgeable very good at studies okay nakshatra also you have to see check the nakshatra in which venus is transiting it will give you many many details regarding your partner you also have to check the houses the nakshatra lord is ruling for example if nakshatra lord is mars and it is ruling the 10th house career changes after marriage can happen this thing is for very sure you want a spouse who can love you truly who can do everything for you who is always available to you and who is always ready to give you their attention who is loyal who is committed who is very romantic who is very good looking who earns well as well it can be important for you that your spouse looks good you may not want that extreme level of good looks but at least decent looks you will want to have okay your partner can also have uh, some artistic skills talents Uh, very in much interested in artistic side of life no matter whatever work they may be doing well placed venus gives spouse who may be wealthy business person educated charming religious also and it also shows you have the great skill to maintain relationships right you have the skill that you can maintain relationships your partner may not have it but you have it if it's not retrograde if it's retrograde then still you have to learn many things right 
if it is unafflicted it will give very harmonious relation you also have to check the sign in beneficial sign it gives very good results if exalted exalted gives very calm type of relation but it can also show that at the later half of your life you may not feel interested in material materialistic romance basically venus exalted gives soul level connection that both the partners want to be connected at the soul level okay and it also shows you can meet your partner very early in your life marriage can also happen very early depending upon where you are living you can meet your partner um, while in school while in high school your partner may also be very much interested in listening music many uh, people may be attracted to your spouse very easily or uh, if venus is strong in your chart and representing you then to you also people may be uh, get uh, people may get attracted to you very easily okay so if mars sun are here it can basically make your partner very aggressive right but if uh, nice planets are here then it can make your partner very kind and with moon mood swings can be there may not be very trustworthy so you have to be careful if you have venus moon strong conjunction you have to be careful a mind is always changing you up the mind of your spouse may always be changing mood swing sometimes they may think something else sometimes they may think something else so this thing can be there with venus and moon venus mercury poetic artistic and very good communication skill very romantic childish youthful attractive and um, a very nice personality it gives when venus and mercury poetic kind of personality and uh, they will be very uh, much into communication communication may be very important for them uh, in relationship highly communicative now then you have to check the sign it is placed in i cannot cover it will make the video very long so you have to see the sign it is placed in aries it can give highly passionate spouse very passionate right strong chances of love marriage and here a relationship will be very important for your partner they can also be possessive and your physical activity may be more important for them traveling hanging out and trying new new things uh, will be the theme of your marriage in ashwini it can give uh, the quality of being a natural healer to your spouse they can also be very restless it also shows that uh, you have to learn many things regarding relationship from your partner or your partner may have to learn many things from you okay but it can make your partner very impatient very possessive and someone who may always want your attention but can also easily get detached in um, bharni it can give someone who is attached to family responsible very mysterious deep thinker creative highly sexual okay and in kritika it can give someone who wants everything to be perfect and uh, sometimes they don't think without speaking blunt speech but creative dominating artistic and they may also be famous and straightforward Th th these type of things can be there can also be adopted child your partner can also be adopted child if venus is in kritika so these are some qualities by this way you can analyze the signs and the nakshatras i cannot cover it because it will be very long so for example i explained you aries so by this way you can see uh, in gemini it can uh, give your partner for whom communication is very important someone who is childish in briksha they can be into acting right uh, in briksha you may you may be searching for a perfect partner in artra nakshatra they can be uh, someone who can be foreign someone who who is highly deeply emotional someone who who is always living in the past and uh, is carrying some wounds from the past life someone who is very outcast so by this way you can analyze 
सो आई होप दिस वीडियो वॉज हेल्पफुल टेक केयर बाय